Super applause, Sun. applause, wow. applause. That yeah. is Chicago's <laughs> Wolves <laughs> Senior Executive Vice President Wayne Mesmer singing the national anthem at the Wolves game. And this weekend is another big one for the w Wayne and his team. It is the team's fifth annual Red Kettle game presented by the Salvation Army. And Wayne joins us this morning along with a uh, special guest I uh, hear <laughs> who'll be joining us a little bit later on. Before we get to the game, I gotta ask you, the national anthem is not an easy mm -hmm. song to sing. How do you pull off those big notes? Um, the gift that I was given. I know that's mm. right. You know, that's that's all it is, man. Because it's an octave and a fifth. Mm -hmm. Yes. You know, and some people uh, should probably drink a fifth before they try. <laughs> but it's, um, you know, you, you lose people on the bottom end, uh -huh. Uh -huh. Or, or the high end. Yeah. Like, yeah. I think I'll bail out on that. That's you should have shared that tip with Fergie before she sung at the well, All-State Game. Oh, they you know, drink um, a fifth and they might not get yeah. the words right. That's so, the problem there. That's another one. <laughs> Let me ask you, uh, why is it so important for the Wolves organization to give back to the community in this way and the many other ways you, you all do? Since, uh, since day one, we're now in our 30th year, and uh, we have had a commitment to, uh, to really helping the community and being a part of it. And uh, a lot of it has to do with the family-friendly atmosphere that we have at mm -hmm. the games. And, uh, you know, and the, the, the price point, you know, dad and mom can come out and bring the babysitter and three kids and not break the bank and uh, so we create a lot of fun opportunities and that extends out into into the community this is a big one uh, for us mm -hmm. uh, to really help the Salvation Army who does such great work mm -hmm. I mean they did a, a million meals last year wow. 400,000 uh, emergency cases that they they spoke about and or, uh, you know came and uh, brought some assistance and 160,000 bags of groceries to families in need and they've got a, a, a goal this year of 18 million so it happens one dollar at a time mm -hmm. and saturday night uh, we'll have the red kettles there and uh, also a red kettle and center ice second period break and you get a puck and you nice. whip it down there and try and, uh, <laughs> Add a little the athletics person. to it, yeah. Uh, yeah. Okay, so you said this is the big one, but you all are involved in so many different things. Right. Talk a little bit more about your charitable initiatives um, that are just near and dear to the Wolves organization. Well, they're led by uh, a, just a, a dynamic person, Courtney Mahoney, who's been with us for many years, and uh, she is uh, she's just dedicated. Mm -hmm. And, uh, I mean, one of the great joys in her life is bringing, uh, bringing happiness to people in the community. One of the things also that we do is the Adopt-a-Dog program. Mm -hmm. And uh, it's, I love those things. We do it, uh, you know, a number of times a year. Folks come out, and, and there are dogs in the kennel, and there are people, <laughs> you know, and they're holding the these. Dogs like, in the kennel or wolves? in the kennel. No, we don't keep wolves. I, I feel like there's a wolf that's gotten out or well, something. Well, there may every once in a while. Oh, 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 I can feel him skating that, around. Yeah. <laughs> no matter where I go, yeah. this guy shows up. <laughs> yeah. What's up, buddy? Who but let the wolves out? <laughs> ah, but we've adopted, they've, uh, over 1,500 dogs have found new homes. That's wonderful. And uh, it's great when you see the smile of somebody's face when they go to a hockey game and the kid comes home hugging a puppy. Or, you know, it's, Absolutely. it's great. Absolutely. That's awesome. This game hard to concentrate awesome. right now with this guy around. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm sure the kids love him. He's all right. <laughs> He's all right. <laughs> well, your voice is more than all right. <laughs> and uh, you can get tickets to the fifth annual Red Kettle game by going to ChicagoWolves.com or tune in as the Wolves take on the San Diego Gulls Saturday night starting at 7. And, of course, you can watch the game live on our sister station, My 50 Chicago. Thank you both for being here today. Just toss him a piece of raw meat. He'll be okay. Oh, boy. <laughs> we'll have to do that in the break. We'll be right back.